In this demo here, I'll be sharing with you how uh, surfaces such as knurling can be created in solid age. Not only surfaces uh, such as knurling can be created, but uh, we can also bring out a particular texture of a surface. Uh, what I'm creating here will be uh, uh, just a cylinder block and uh, and uh, all using this cylinder block and a surface to create knurling. There is no specific function uh, in uh, creating knurling surfaces in solid age, but um, what we can do is that. <coughs> We can go to the format style and um, before that uh, before that we go to format style make sure that uh, your texture is on and uh, you can select based on any of the color for example in this case I'm just using a blue and uh, <clears throat> I'm selecting a new and uh, tuck in as uh, and uh, in this uh, case here uh, I captured uh, from internet a knurling surface, a clear shot of a knurling surface in a JPEG format, and uh, I'm I'll be using this uh, uh, JPEG file here to create that. I'm going to change the scale to X to 0.6, and um, as you can see here, the preview will give me uh, how the part is going to look, uh, and then. Uh, <coughs> rotation uh, I might be change that to uh, either slide you can even slide that or key in a value and apply uh, this function here apply right and you can close this yeah apply we go back to the uh, uh, format and uh, part painter and uh, bring out the knurling that we have and uh, okay and, uh, further edit this okay uh, by uh, go to format and style and uh, choose the option uh, face style uh, bring out the knurling uh, properties and based on this knurling property here, uh, you can do further editing. Okay, you can even fine tune that. Okay. Uh, you can even change the scale from uh, 0 0.5 to 0 0.7. Uh, yeah. So based on that, uh, when you apply this. Uh, you'll find that the uh, uh, f the, the feature will be uh, changed as well and um, uh, you can even bring this to create a drawing okay. Um, as such, this um, I'm going to apply some views of the knurling that I created in the uh, part modeling in this drafting file here. What I have to do is that you have that uh, shaded icon. Just click on that shaded icon and uh, don't forget to update your view. Once you have updated your view, you'll find that the surface that you have created in the part modeling is visible in the um, uh, drafting environment. So this is a, a simple way, simple uh, demo how you can, uh, you can uh, retrieve some knurling and other surfaces, uh, textures in the solid age and your design. Alright, thank you.